Hey, what's up? It's Walanda and welcome back to my channel. In this video, I'm going to be showing you guys how I achieved this look. This is crochet and I absolutely love it. It's, it really fits my face and definitely will be doing this method again. So if you're interested in see how I achieved this look, go ahead and stay tuned. All right, so my hair is low key dirty, y'all. Um, I've been working out all week and I was about to get on a flight the next day to go to New York. So I needed something protective style, but cute. So I went ahead and start, just decided to do crochet. I'm just going to part out my leave out. So I did around my edges and in the middle because I am doing a side part. Well, not in the middle, on the side, you know what I mean. So I went ahead and braid down everything else y'all i had a broken fingernail and <laughs> i tried my best to braid it as tight as i could i am using the free dress puta kind of twist i love this hair because it just matches my hair perfectly it's that real real kinky looking afro hairstyle i got it in i think a 1b i could have gotten away with a 2 but it is what it is i went ahead and cut it in half it comes in, I think, three different um, bundles, but I use about two in some of the three. So if you don't know how to crochet, it's really easy. You just have a latch, you put it in under your braids, you attach the hair to the latch, you pull it over and you tie it. So I wanted it to be very lightweight but full. Instead of going through with each one strand, I went ahead and split that strand in half so it could have a more fluffier look and so it can definitely curl better. So I went ahead and combed out my entire hair. This will give it a very um, fluffy look when you go ahead and twist it up to deep it to dip to to dip it in water I just love how natural this really seamlessly blend with my hair look at that y'all Look at that. Love it, love it, love it. I love me some big kinky hair. I just love natural hair, period. So I'm gonna go ahead and comb out a section, wrap it around the flexi rod, and dip it in hot water. I let this sit overnight, even though it still wasn't completely dry. It is what it is. I, I had to get on the flight, y'all. So the next day, I carefully unraveled them and I went ahead and separated them a little bit. Y'all see that one piece? Ugh, irritating. I went ahead and separated them a little bit, not too much, just a little bit so it could get fluffy again and it could be full. I went ahead and used cute little pins to style it just a little bit. And y'all, this is my final look. I absolutely love how this came out. It's uniform, but not too uniform where it looks fake. It looks like my hair to the T. Absolutely love it. If you guys enjoyed this video, go ahead and please thumbs up. This was very, very, uh... It wasn't as quick as it could be, but it wasn't as long as it could have been either. So I love how natural this hair looks. Very, 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 very natural and super easy to do. So let me know if you want any other hair tutorials. I might get back on those. <laughs> yeah, I know. Please leave a comment down below. Like, subscribe, and share this video. Thank you guys so much for watching, and I'll see you in the next. Bye.